the Air Force's newest fighter jet, the F-35A, is going through its first deployment capability test at Mountain Home Air Force Base. It's not every day that a new aircraft platform comes out. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. While this fifth-generation stealth aircraft is dropping bombs over Sailor Creek Range, everyone behind the scenes is working together to make sure the F-35 reaches initial operational capability, or IOC, by fall of this year. My overall responsibility with the F-35 is basically the maintenance management portion to ensure the aircraft's fleet health stays in a, as a positive way. My role is material management, so I'm responsible for all the aircraft spares. If a part breaks, it's my responsibility to ship that part back to depot for repair and return. As a crew chief, my job is to maintain the aircraft, make sure my aircraft is basically spotless in every way. My role in preparing was to assist my reception superintendent, Sergeant Georgiana, and sending email coordination. We introduced them to POCs on our installation that will provide them support that they would need while they're here. The F-35s are originally from Edwards Air Force Base in California, and when coming to a new base, teamwork is important in making sure operations run smoothly. Definitely coming to a new base, there's a lot of challenges in having the people on base help you out. We've made a lot of trips to uh, POL and DI, working with the MOC and the fire department, crash recovery, and uh, even using the tire shop. The taxiing locations, the runway locations, all of that's new, um, but we do make sure our airmen are familiar with these areas to ensure that they operate safely and efficiently as they would at home. They came out for a site survey, and we helped set that up. We contact all the agencies on base that uh, they would need support from. Mountain Home has been fantastic, especially the, the communication squadron, because ALICE is a computerized system and it requires a lot of network support to get that online and operating so we can manage the maintenance on the F-35. LRS specifically, they've been very helpful with making sure that our parts that are coming on base come to their TMO and they also deliver them to us. We just appreciate them lending their hand. Uh, F-35 crew, working with them, their maintainers, their air crew, Absolutely flawless, um, seamless transition from the time they got here. We couldn't ask for a better TDY. With any task, like teamwork is the theme of the Air Force, so just like it takes more than one maintainer to launch a jet, it takes our entire team to make sure that we reach our goal. After years of working through spending issues and overcoming technical obstacles, the F-35 is one step closer to being deployable, and everyone involved has one focus. Launch the jets, get the mission done, we're rocking and rolling. Our mission is to fly this jet as hard as we can and find any flaws or issues that there will be. So far, it's been going really well. Any hiccups we've had, we've been able to turn it around and make it work. This is history in the making, and I'm just proud to be a part of it.